Do you shop online? Let me show you what the future of shopping technology looks like. Hi, my name is Masha and I wrote my undergraduate dissertation about online shopping. I'm not kidding, I studied economics and I even came up with a risk assessing formula for decision making. This video isn't about that though, it's about the future of e-commerce and how one Swedish fintech startup is reinventing the user experience of online shopping. I will walk you through what they've come up with in a minute, but first let me introduce this company to you. This startup is Klarna and I'm super excited to have partnered up with them to spread the word about their awesome innovation. Klarna is creating the future of online shopping and is introducing a smoother, with an extra O, shopping experience. Online shopping has been around for 24 years now. Someone made history in 1994 by making the first online transaction ever by purchasing a CD or a compact disc for all the kids who don't know what it stands for uh, of Sting. And that kicked off a trend. Amazon and eBay were both born in 1995 and there were so many other e-commerce retailers that followed after that. And some people were super amazed by this new technology while some were pretty skeptical. That was a huge milestone for the tech industry. And since then, the tech and the user experience have obviously improved drastically. However, as someone who is very passionate about technology and development, constant development in user experience, I can still see some areas that can be improved. Let's look at some of those right now. Let me know if you can relate in the comments. First of all, there are too many forms that you need to fill out all the time. And also sharing your credit card details with every single website that you purchase from feels very weird and insecure. Secondly, there's no way to aggregate all of your favorite online stores. So this shopping experience is kind of dispersed. Thirdly, yes, you can create wish lists on all of these different websites for the items that you'd like to watch or maybe purchase later, but there's no way to aggregate those either. So unless you're super organized and keep all of your notes in the same place, you're probably going to forget about the 70% 70, 70 of them. Fourthly, or number four, if you want to buy your favorite items when they go on sale, you have to manually check when they go on sale. So you basically have to manually track them down or you have to wait for Black Friday sales. There's no way to kind of get alerts on when your favorite items go on sale, at least not on every website. Number five is when holiday shopping comes around and you buy a ton of gifts, you will have to pay off the slump sum all at once. That is, of course, if you don't want it to affect your credit score. Number six is sometimes you don't know what you're going to get. Will this item arrive broken or faulty? A lot of websites don't have returns or buyer's protection. That was actually a huge risk variable in my dissertation. And finally, number seven, sometimes it takes a long time to get reimbursed for the items that you have returned. There are obviously more user experience gaps that one can identify, but those are the biggest areas for me personally. And guess what? Klarna has found a way to address all of those points and even more, to create a smoother, with an extra O, shopping experience. It has created a place where you can aggregate all of your shopping. You can do it all from their app. With Klarna, you can keep all of your payment and shipping information in one place and keep track of your spending across different categories. You can also create wish lists with different items from different retailers and set up notifications for yourself when those items go on sale, which means that you don't have to manually monitor your favorite websites for sales anymore. And you can also break your payments into installments. Yes, this is making me so much less stressed out about the next holiday season and all of the gifts that I need to pay off. Does that sound awesome? Explore Klarna using the link in my description. They have payment integrations with many different merchants. And if you're shopping from a store that hasn't integrated with Klarna yet, they have an awesome feature for that, ghost guards. Those are super simple to create and use. They allow you to pay for your items using a ghost credit card that's created by Klarna, which again, allows you to pay in installments. Learn more about Klarna using the link in my description. In fact, let's create a ghost card right now. As a gadget nerd, I've been very curious about Apple pencils and I've been wanting to purchase one for a while, but $99 seems like a lot for something that has pencil in its name. But it's a useful gadget and I need one right now. So if I break it up into 
four installments, this payment doesn't feel as bad. All right, let's do this. First, you need to open the Klarna app and I already have an account, so it's super easy for me to log in using my PIN, Face ID or fingerprint. Click on Ghost Cards and create new card. As you can see, there's so many different merchants that are on the platform already, but I'm just going to use uh, the search function to find Apple because I want to purchase from them and enter the amount that I know that this item will cost. I will add 10% because I know I'll be charged taxes. You can see how much I will be charged per every installment. And finally, let's create my ghost card. Voila, it's that easy. You can use your ghost card immediately or within the next 24 hours. And if you've changed your mind and you don't want to purchase this item anymore, it will automatically disappear if you don't use it within the next 24 hours. So there we go. I've purchased my Apple Pencil and I'll go pick it up after I'm done recording because there's an Apple store a couple of blocks away. What's awesome about Klarna is that it allows you to make big purchases without them affecting your monthly budget too much. And if you've decided to return the item that you've purchased with Klarna, you won't have to pay off the remaining amount and you will be reimbursed for whatever you've already paid. This makes life so much easier and smoother. Smoother. If you're curious to try it, then load the Klarna app right now. You will find a link to it in my description. Let me know what your favorite feature is in the comments. Like this video if you've enjoyed it and share it with your friends who enjoy online shopping as much as you do or as much as I do, which is a lot. We can also be friends on other social media. You can find me as Coding Blonde. Have a wonderful time of the day you're currently experiencing. Bye.